the Traveler has abandoned Mercury. There stands the possibility that it would never cross paths with humanity. You, I, and all we've worked for would cease to exist. Call the Legion, and force this reality shut. Erase this history, Guardian. The Red Legion will use it as a pathway to their ideal future. The Traveler in pieces. Humanity doomed. The Traveler has hidden itself in this timeline. I believe the Cabal wish to find it. The plates here are a link to the Vex network, and the Red Legion will try to access the secrets within. That is, if you do not stop them. The Traveler has fled from the Cabal, and I believe they hope to use Vex technology to find it. It will not function well in their clumsy hands, but we must stop them all the same. The sky is empty. If the Traveler left Mercury, we must consider the prospect that it would one day abandon Earth. I'm detecting intrusions into the Vex network. These... These are my bypass signatures. They're using my sundial to access the forest. Break their integration attempts. Guardian, you see the Traveler? Neither do I. These science pursue something beyond simply changing the course of a war. Whatever they are attempting to access, lock them out. In this timeline, the Cabal have recreated Mercury's past in their own image. Even the Traveler has fled. We cannot allow the Cabal to find it. I have broken various Vex systems and subroutines, but the invasive program I'm reading within the network here is different, erratic. It's a shifting code rooted directly in the minds of the counselors here. Sever the ties. You have dashed their hopes of reshaping the past. If we navigate these timelines correctly, we will preserve the present and keep the Traveler in our skies. The Legion pull time apart with no consideration for the damage they cause. For all they know, they've undone themselves. If only we were so lucky. You have dashed their hopes of reshaping the past. If we navigate these timelines correctly, we will preserve the present and keep the Traveler in our skies. Without its leader, does the Red Legion remain united under a shared purpose? Or has the deposed Emperor slipped his followers into their ranks? Why did the Traveler flee? What did it see in the ugly intentions of the Cabal? Its own demise, perhaps. And us along with it. The Cabal have always sought Vex technology. It is only logical that the Forest would draw the Legion's interests eventually. I should have foreseen this. For years in the Forest, I chased the horizons of Mercury. I had hoped to touch the ancient wisdom of the Traveler, but it did not know me. As I approached, it drifted ever farther from my grasp. But here, to look up and see nothing, this must be how the Fallen felt. If the Red Legion had succeeded, this timeline would be the trailhead to a world handshaked by the Cabal. Endless war. Brutal technology. Perversion of the light. The Scions appear to have been forging a back channel into the Vex network. They're searching for a universal access protocol. The Legion's goal here, multifaceted, or at least they were. Petabytes of encrypted data were being streamed out towards a multitude of distant star clusters. They're calling out to other Legions, offering Vex technology. Thanks to you, this Legion will remain isolated. I can only speculate about the Red Legion's true intentions. But I fear they see the infinite forest as a threat. They hope to destroy it. You cannot allow them, Guardian. I am not finished with it. 
A million branches are cast out before them, and they choose to see each split into a million more. With the forest under cabal control, they will create more realities. It will continue on and on until one connects to the end they desire. Best to end this endeavor before it begins, Guardian. The Cabal have chased the Traveler from the sky, and now I believe they seek to collapse the Infinite Forest. With the Forest close to us, we will have little hope of stopping them. The Red Legion, the Vex, each wish for total domination. One cannot abide the other for this reason. The Legion seeks to destroy the Infinite Forest. You must stop them. To seal shut the passage into the forest would breed far more harm than good. Relieve these cabal of their high aspirations. No traveler hangs in this Mercurian sky. But I can feel the presence of its light. What have they done? There are secrets still to be uncovered in the forest. I cannot allow it to be sealed. Not yet. I have always questioned the Traveler, but to see an empty sky... I wasn't prepared. I have overseen too many useful experiments in the Infinite Forest to lose such an important testing ground. You've done well to ensure it remains open. If the Traveler fled the system, there is a chance that the darkness would ignore our region of the galaxy entirely. It would sacrifice our second awakening, our ability to wield the light, but potentially continue our golden age. There are too many variables at risk, but it's a variant path worth investigating in the infinite forest. I wonder where this timeline would have led. The resurrection of Dominus Gaul? The reinstatement of the exiled emperor? I cannot say for certain. The infinite forest is preserved. For now. I wish to decide the fate of those endless passages myself. We have not yet reached the end of its usefulness. The Legion's tampering has left this timeline fraught with inconsistencies. If you hadn't forced its collapse, they would have caused permanent damage. Well done. The Infinite Forest is itself a threat. But allowing the Cabal to destroy it would alter the future in ways even I am unable to predict. Stopping them was our only option. Their shields could not keep you out. These will not be the last barricades to impede you, nor will they be the last to shatter against your advance. Press on, Guardian. I have seen a far future with a scion at its center. It is a bleak place. Do you know what a mind prison is, Guardian? Ask the Emperor about his nightmare realm. The scion flayers do not perceive time as you and I do, Guardian. It is not linear to them. This is their strength and our limitation. Be aware of it. Steal yourself. Remember what is at stake. Everything, Guardian. Everything. The Scion Flayers will not stop unless we stop them. If we do not pull them out at the root, they will sprout up elsewhere and poison everything in reach. Watch your step here. The Scions are owned by the Cabal, but not dictated by them. Brute force is not their method. They think in more intricate patterns. Careful, Guardian. Your foe will fill your path with obstacles and evade you at the last moment. You must not let this discourage you. The Flayers are not ordinary scions. Even one is a formidable enemy. You must bring all your guile to this fight. The people of this system will not realize the extent of what you've done. That is the bittersweet nature of our duty. Our success is often invisible. Our failure would be catastrophic. 
Where were the Scion Flayers during the Red War? In prison? In hiding? It is worth investigating. But the Sundial has drawn them out, and we must drive them back. That Scion would have seen all of humanity enslaved under its banner. A traveler as we know it would be... nothing but a myth. Thank you, Guardian. Mercury is a dangerous place, and yet for me it has been a, a space of learning, a library. I was not prepared to feel so protective of such a vicious place. We believe the Red Legion have no leader. I think we should question our intelligence. Something has united them, or else we would not be here. You won this battle. Together, I believe we can win the war. I have seen that future, Guardian.